All right, what's up? We have numero uno today. The king, Lord DeBuzz, gracing us with his presence once again. Congratulations. Thank Good you, stuff, sir. Good stuff, dude. Like, you're such a pillar of consistency. <laughs> it's actually ridiculous, bro. Like... Yeah. I said it before this that I was like, this is either going to be like super close or this is going to be the biggest 3-0 vibe check I've seen. And sure enough, I got the biggest 3-0 vibe check yeah. I've seen. You, like, know, you know what it is? Because Kofi just has a mental block with me. Yeah. I've talked about it, you know. He's trying to learn the matchup, but uh, every time I play him, he just kind of like, he gives up. You know he doesn't tr show it. I feel like when I play him, he'll just like be down. He'll just be like, I can't win this anymore. You whittle them down. Like it, I saw your set with numbers, bro. I think running a marathon would require less like mental <laughs> endurance than seeing that, bro. That was like, uh, yeah, I I'm, was enamored. I'm so fine with that because I will, I will out camp anyone. If you want to just not approach me, that's fine. I will approach you with my conditions, and I will still camp you. Yeah. So like, numbers, <laughs> you were doing such a. <laughs> wait, wait. Why is Utopian dabbing? I can do that too. <laughs> this is so you gotta do this, bro. <laughs> oh no, I gotta do it like this. You gotta do it fully vertically. Yeah, that's perfect, bro. Got that, that hot 90 degree angle on the tap. <laughs> Lord the buzz coming through Literally. with the quality content, right? You you killed it today, dude. I get, I <laughs> oh my I get it, bro. Oh, but that's so good. <laughs> uh. Yeah. I think they said that was. <laughs> You're trying to do it too. <laughs> I couldn't arc it that, uh, oh that hot, though. You were good. I got to say, your pop off on Eric is the best pop off I've ever seen you do. That was really good. Really? I just did good like shit. Yes, no, that was good though. Like I could feel the genuine emotion coming from it. Like you you killed it, bro. You yeah. killed it. I, I killed him at 70 and I was like, I don't deserve this, but he messed up, so that's yeah. cool. There you yeah. go. Yeah, no, that was a that was a hard side. I lost him at Xeno last week. Yeah, he took it over you and Venny, right? So that yeah. was like you you definitely had like a, a took statement to, to make for sure. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he only he took one game off my Olimar and then I tried like Rosa two of the games and Palo one of the games, so but still, no, yeah, he beat me in legit sets, be trying hard, so I was like, I, I can't let this happen again. Yeah. I, I so have to establish myself as king of New York. I gotta keep this going. Um, what did you do after that? Like, did you, were there, was there any prep coming back into it? Did you reshift your mental state? Um, or were you just like, I'm gonna collect data in a more, in a different way? When I just watched the set, all I did was think to myself, all right, why am I getting hit? I realized, so I was actually playing, um, a Lucina early. I can't remember his tag right now. Someone with was it S stretch. Yeah, that's why I played him in yeah, bracket. Yeah. We he's probably like the second best in the state right now. It's yeah, a, he's yeah. solid. Yeah, he's good. So we play a lot of friendlies after that, and um, I realized when I was fighting him that like I take a lot of damage with Lucina by just kind of being too close to the ledge versus him when I'm ledge trapping him. So I just said, you know, what? I'll just back off. You're, you're a sortie. You can have this ledge. You can get on stage, but I'm throwing Pikmin at you and forward smashes <laughs> and keeping you in the corner. That worked. Like I was getting purple chucks on him, some fairs, and like I wasn't getting. Big conversions, except you like were once keeping away though. Like you were a wall. Like yeah. you were a full on. And wall. like when he just gets up, if he can't jump because I'm giving him too much distance to jump aerial, and he can't roll, he has to get up. He's just gonna take chip damage, and that was my goal. And that was, I think, a huge adaptation. Also, just not jumping at him as much. Like if he was in the air, and I didn't have like a clean, like easy conversion, easy follow up, easy pressure. It's Lucina. I, she outswings everyone, right? So you have to just land, back off, and say, you know what? This is your airspace. I will land the ground. I'll catch your landing if I can. Yeah, but your, your landing catches with purple like were actually great. Like you, every time they had to neutral air dodge or that you forced them into a frame trap scenario, mm -hmm. you had purple on deck to just whip it out yep, on them real yep. quick. Throw it at them, put them at the ledge again, and say, hey, yeah, I didn't chase in the air, but I did get purple side before five damage in the lead position again. Like you, that's you, like versus Lucina like, character. Eggplant you have to. emoji is yeah. all I have to say to that. You eggplant emoji them. Can I see eggplant hard. emojis in the chat now? <laughs> just, just all of them. Uh, so I know, we're winding down here. Uh, what is what was your what's your favorite? Uh, Hangman told me to ask you this. What's your favorite anime of the season so far? Right favorite now? anime? Yeah. I'll be honest. I've only been watching Vinland Saga this season. I get to actually. So I'm waiting for a summit fight to be like, hey guys, on Twitter, all you nerds, recommend weebs, right. recommend me some delicious anime, something I could just say, this is great. <laughs> and so I'm going to find out what's actually good on my flight to Summit, and then I'll let you know. But right now, Vinland Saga is pretty hot, man. Yeah, okay. You know, it's a, there's Vikings, there's blood, and there's murder, oh, and there's gore, sick. and there's that's great story. Sick. And like, the protagonist is like a villain, but he's not, and it's weird, it's, it's mad hot. You're going to get a lot of Demon Slayer for sure. Oh, Demon Slayer get a was. Lot of Demon Slayer, right? Oh, yeah, that was last season. That was. Yeah. No, I mean like stuff like airing now, because I watched Demon oh, Slayer. Okay. That was like the most mediocre anime with the most amazing animation ever. Mm. I'm saying it's a good thing, Demon Slayer, because I know someone's <laughs> about to say in chat, "Wait, how are you hitting on the Demon Slayer to buzz?" Heck, no, no. <laughs> Demon Slayer is sick because it's made by Ufotable and they make like the Fate like movies and just all the 
ridiculous animations. Photo was I good. I think, didn't they make some food anime too, I believe? I think they may have done a season of Shogeki, Shogeki no, no Soma. Soma. I think they did. Right? Like, and they knocked it out of the park with that I one. feel like they have the magic touch. Anything they touch, it turns the gold. It's gold, bro. It's it, good. Oh, I love it. Like uh, this. And yeah, yeah so that's it. I guess go. there's nothing else to say. You know, we had this conversation. There was a, uh, <laughs> you know, I threw Pikmin at people all day. I yeah, didn't and you did a good job. I, I didn't even do anything flash today. I feel like today was extra lame day for me. But um, you played, you, you were super solid with it though. Like you never wavered with how your game plan. Like you stuck yeah. to it. And even when you had to make the adaptations, you did. So I mean. Yeah. Play, play to win, dude. Honestly, yeah, yeah. like, sh like anyone saying, "Oh, he's playing lame." Like, shut up, bro. Like, play to win. Uh, yeah. Is there anything else you'd like to add before we um, get tuned out? No, I think that's it. You know, uh, you should totally follow me on my follow socials, him. please. Like Twitter, him. Twitch, yeah, t everything. I have a anything. streamer. He streams a lot too. So, if yep, you want I'm to actually trying to tomorrow do a pumpkin stream. I want, I want carving. Pumpkin. That's sick, I, bro. I, I've done two in a row, that's sick. and I'm trying to eventually have a decent pumpkin carving because the first year was. Like, it was okay, but not awful. Yeah. The second year was a mess. <laughs> I actually destroyed this pumpkin. So this year, I'm getting two pumpkins, and I'm going to make sure I make the freaking Mona Lisa on this. Just <laughs> <laughs> All right, yeah. Well, great All job. Right. Always you, a pleasure. Peace out. Peace out, guys. Have a good night.